Hey Luke here with CatsAndCarp.com and this is the 2015 Summer Fishing at the Washington DC Tidal Basin. Uh, great get together, we had people coming from as far as North Carolina, met a lot of nice new people, saw a lot of, of uh, new carp gear and carp baits and techniques and, and uh, it was just a really great chance to meet some nice people and hang out and, and land some fish. Uh, we caught some nice carp and plenty of catfish and just had a great time. But I pulled out my video camera and, and got a chance to interview everybody and, and see how they catch the carp. Hey guys, uh, Lee Standard here, uh, Chester, Virginia, just south of Richmond, about a two hour drive uh, south of here. Um, I'm the newbie of the group. Uh, really my only carp rig is this Daiwa Mad Dragon, um, 13 foot, uh, it's a three and a half uh, pound test curve. Love it. Um, when my budget allows them, might get a couple more. But anyway, uh, I got that paired with a, a Daiwa Optimum uh, 4500 series uh, nice. bait runner. Yeah, a um, brand new pod. That is my first time I've used this pod. Is um, that NGT? It's a, it is. It's a, kind of a mid mid NGT. Uh, got that from Big Cart Tackle. It's a good looking one, yeah. Yeah, I like it. It's low profile, but uh, it, it'll work for my situations here. And then that I have bank perfect. sticks if I need to get my tips up. Yeah. Um, but I, like I said, I'm new to this. I'm mostly a fly fisherman. Um, but moving over to carp, I've been dabbling with it for maybe. Well, uh, probably 10 months now and learning, a lot more to learn. What kind of bait are you using? Are you... Uh, today, I'm actually using a live system boilies, um, and that I've hand rolled myself. You got, a pit, you got those hand rolls? Well, let's, yeah, let's, yeah, yeah. let's shoot a photo of those. I'm glad I'm not the only one who misplaces stuff. Oh, put them in the shade. Oh, 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 I know. Put them in the cooler. Oh, yeah. Put them in the shade. It's getting warm. Yeah, these things smell awesome. They're like a coconut, right? Is that what I smell? Mm, like, no, it's uh, hemp oil. Is that hemp oil? It, it smells... It, it's smells... Hemp oil. it is a nutty, sweet yeah. uh, mix. I, I don't know exactly. It's top secret. You know, it's the Live System Boys. Uh, it's CC Moore product. You get a little beep right there? Yeah, yeah, bump it. He's bumping it, he just won't pick it up and go with it, though. He's yeah, you hand rolled all of You got some dumbbells in yeah, there. Got some... Yeah, work my tail off on those. Those are the beauties, man. That, I, I can tell you, if it smells like, like uh, <laughs> the carbs have the same sense of smell I do, they're going to love those. Those smell really good. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Anyway, yes. Oh, we got the paddle boats out here. Channel cab. All right, pose with Moby Dick there, Lee. Hold it really close to the camera. <laughs> All right, man. Oh, yes. <laughs> Cats and car. Oh, we love catfish. Yeah, that's right. Hold the live bully system. I don't need that. No, he was putting a bend in that rod. He was a go-getter. That thing looked like it was fighting pretty good. Yeah, he got that live system, didn't he? Look at that back lead doing the job. Oh, Ooh, he just barely hooked it. Fell out. Nice little channel cat. Yeah, it's a beauty. Yeah. Good eating style. Sure you don't want it? No, Fit good. right in your pocket. I'm good. All right. We still got, we're still wandering. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, this is Jeff. He came down from Maryland and brought yeah, with my, him some gorgeous pen rod and reel sets. Sure. And uh, he uh, came gunning for catfish. He was fishing with the Pro Cure chicken liver um, and uh, did pretty well with it. Yeah, these are good. These are good. Those are nice rods. Take these surf fishing? I do. I do. Um, I mean, there's uh, Point Lookout, Sandy Point, a couple other places, and uh, they perform very, very well. <laughs> nice. I mean, I can't complain. I mean, they only got some backbone, but still some sensitivity to oh, them, you yeah. know what I mean? That nice little balance, you know? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, you can't go wrong with pin. Yeah. At, at least for my personal... Uh, oh, the pen battle? Oh, yeah, that's... Too, yeah. 
That is a sexy rod. You got some very attractive ladies here. Oh, is... <laughs> that's that's that uh that a uh, VA money there. Nice. You know, ah, look at that. That's the boilie, right? Yep, it sure is. Yeah, that's on the dynamite crab and crayfish boilie. Not, not, not yeah. serious. Oh my god. That's serious. Yeah. We just about it and oh, yeah, that's a good cat. Hit. That's a catfish rig, right? Oh, he really? That's like really, really. He's probably be just charging. Yeah. That's how the pro here, right? That's gotta be a catfish. Wow. Well, let's see him. Let's see him. Oh, that's a decent blue. Yeah, that's a decent blue. Calm down. Well, look at that. It's a nice. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, he's nice and fat too. That's a good one. <laughs> All right, All man, right. good job. Good I, job. I, I, I'm good for the day. <laughs> that's a real. That's a nice blue catfish. <laughs> Let's go. Well, why don't you introduce yourself and tell us uh, what you're fishing with. Okay, uh, my name is Joe Venable, I'm from Virginia Beach, Virginia, and I am fishing today with uh, my middle rod. I'm fishing a, a Panko Oats uh, pack bait, uh, which I got from John Finney, uh, one of my carping Facebook friends out in Colorado. And uh, in the uh, on my left and right rods, I'm fishing uh, a float setup, which is kind of a semi-running rig. Uh, with uh, and I'm using. So you got your uh, bait dragon on the bottom, but a float. Is that kind of what it is? It's, or? it's got a. It's got a. Um, oh, I don't know what you call those sinkers. The like inline sinker. Yeah. And a foot up. It's got a split shot, so yeah. they can run a foot and then it's going to stop. And gotcha, hit. gotcha, gotcha. And um, these are self-adjusting floats, Polaris floats. They get you know, caught to the, whatever depth you're fishing, and uh, so they give you some bite indication. And uh, and I'm fishing right now. I'm fishing prepared corn. Uh, on all three rigs, but I have boilies and I have tiger nuts and I have pop-ups and other things as well We'll see how the day goes I'm catapulting corn out to these float rods that are near and I'm changing method about every 15 minutes to try to get fish interested hey, Cool <laughs> so. That's not a, is that an NGT rod pod or it is. is yes, it is nice Yeah, Brian, uh, It's perfect for this place I think you recommended to me uh, the rod pod that I've got, and I have a... Oh yeah, the Fox Stalker... Uh, oh, i got to tell you, I that love thing that. is brilliant. I love There's that so thing. so much. Oh yeah, in yeah. In the middle, and in the side, I mean, it's, it's I'm six rods plus a ton of other junk. Yeah. I've got this other Fox carry-all as well yeah. over here. Ooh, and yours looks like it's had a, light, a nicer life than mine. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm an abusive, I'm an abusive harder. fisherman. But, you know, I've got this other carry-all oh, here, nice and that, that is enough for almost all my tackle items. Nice. Uh, really nice. And then I've got a... Oh, yeah, 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 I got this one. Uh, yeah, I love this. I think this I got is... this recommendation from you, and I, I absolutely love this one. I'm... I like the, the line bag, too, because I spill all my bait in there, and then yeah. it's, like, not so raunchy. Well, when I'm stalking, I just need that, a net, and a, and a rod, and I'm good. I, I've awesome. got everything I need. And, um, so I, and I do a lot of that. I do a lot of... Uh, a lot of stalking, a lot of float fishing in a little lake behind my house when I got an hour or two. And that thing is perfect. And I have a a fox, the big, you know, oh, rucksack, the rucksack coming. Yeah. That's, that was my birthday present. It's not <laughs> here yet, but my birthday was Wednesday, so it's kind of a belated birthday present for me. But what a gorgeous spot, too. Wow, it's so, so picturesque. Been on camera before. Yeah, no problem, no problem. <laughs> yeah, Man, yeah. listen, anybody can do it. Perfect, Trust me. Perfect. <laughs> hey, listen. So, well, introduce yourself. And where you're from? Uh, my name is Matthew. I'm from Raleigh, North Carolina. I just came up today to 
meet like-minded carpers and uh, have some fun. Oh man, you got a long drive. Yeah, absolutely. It was about four hours. Left the house at 1 a.m. today, so oh. put in some effort to make it up here. Oh, that's awesome. Is this your is this your broily setup? Yeah, this is the home for the day. Uh, nice little sport umbrella. I like it. You can it. see everything strewn about. Um, brought the cracked corn, some sweet tea. Make sure um, you say corn on the end of that, because that means something different around here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Cracked brought, corn, brought the crack absolutely. corn. This yeah. has been the bait for the day. Oh, just a uh, Scopex. Um, yeah, picked up at Resistance Tackle. Um, what three ninety nine? So very cheap, made by K One Baits. Nice. Yeah, yeah. That's what caught the fish. Uh, a little bit of boilies as well. Yeah, and it was um, what a what an eighteen pounder. Yeah, about an eighteen pounder. It's fun. Sweet. Uh, a big drop back. Uh, I'd left to go get my sunglasses, and they were screaming that the rod was going off. So <laughs> it's always when you walk it away. It's Absolutely. always when you walk away. I, I should walk away again. <laughs> Absolutely. Now, now, you spotting? Yeah, that was just a spot in a mix of sweet tea, or, uh, that and some uh, nice. chopped up boilies. Uh, it's fishing's been slow, so just trying to see if we can get some more action. Well, what rod is this? This is a good looking rod. Here. Yeah, that's an old, uh, one of the Huxley's, one of the original signature series. Oh. So I think it's pretty stiff, that's why I like it. You can heave a, a good bit. And that's the uh, the large size yeah, spawn. Yeah. So have no problems getting everything out there at all. You're dropping spawns. Yeah, yeah, yeah. dropping spawns. Yeah, yeah. You can DC it at that. <laughs> yeah. you got, so you got the, you got the rod pod here. Yeah, that's the, uh, the anaconda pod. That was one of my first ones. Who, uh, who makes the Anaconda? Is that Century? Uh, yeah, I think Sanger. Sanger. Uh, I think it's like a European brand. Just picked it up nice. from a local retailer. Uh, so far, so good. Oh, I really? Like you got a local guy? You buy just down in Carolina, then, huh? Yeah, that was a uh, resistance tackle. So I think now he's oh. just making leads. So it's good to have him so close. Was resistance down in Carolina? It is. It is. It's down I didn't in, know uh, that. in Graham. Um, so I think his rods, uh, the Lightnings, I think they were like $80. I've had them now for two years, no problems at all. Handling three ounces, up to six ounces. So slowly but surely just building a setup. Oh, and nice and sexy Daiwa emblems there. Those? Yeah, the emblems, just pick those up. Uh, just a conventional reel. Um, Do you have a quick like drag them. on them or the normal Not drag? Not a quick drag, just a normal drag. But uh, they get the job done, and you can take those to the salt water as well. Phylar, so what are those? Uh, yeah, not ready to spin the big bucks, so those are just the AGTs. They get the job done. Cool. Yeah. Cool. And look at this view right here, man. You, got yeah, you can't beat this at all. This is the Jefferson what? Memorial. And you have all the other hot spots around. A lot of tours checking it out as well. Beautiful. All right. So this is like uh, like what like fruity pebble cereal or something? Yeah, or? yeah, yeah. Yeah, with the uh, Jello in it. Yeah. Oh, that's that's nice. That's tough. Yeah. Oh. Sticky. So you just add water till till the cereal soggy, yeah, then yeah, add the Jello. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. Oh, that's oh I can smell it from here. It's a very strong smell. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's nice. And you got a high low rig. That's a classic classic rig. Got one hook up here, one hook down there. I've caught a lot of carp and catfish on that. That's yeah. a good rig. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> all right. Well, thank you. Oh, uh, thank you, sir. Hey, what's what's your name? Where are you from? Yeah, I'm from Pernod, Virginia. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but let, 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 show me your gear, man. What what rods you got here? Yeah, it's a JRC. JRC, nice. Yeah. They're, they're sexy rods, man. Yeah, Look nice and yeah, thin, yeah, you know? Yeah, it's, it's pretty thin, yeah. It's pretty nice, yeah, it works for me. And the, the alarms, who yeah, makes Newell's, the alarms? Yeah. Oh, who? Newell's. No, Newell's? Yeah, yeah. So you got the Solara uh, rod pod, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, sturdy rod pod. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, using a mixed bait? Yep. What's the, what's the browns? Did, what's your base? The uh, hemp seeds inside. A uh, hemp seed? Yeah, and uh, some tiger nuts. Crushed tiger nuts. Crushed tiger nuts? Yeah, 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 stuff like that, yeah. Oh, yeah. Takes a lot, a lot of tigers to get that much tiger yeah, nuts. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, you got, fine. and you got the broilie and, of course, yeah. the, uh, yeah, the wheelbarrow. This morning, it was really rainy. rainy. Yeah, you came late, so... Well, some of yeah. us got to get our beauty sleep, you know? It's just... <laughs> I'm an old man. I'm fishing. Oh, yeah. How big was the fish you caught? 
Huh? How big was your fish? Yeah, the fish was something like 10, 15 or something. 10, 15? Yeah. Well, we're going to say it's 15 then. <laughs> okay, yeah, up to you. But we round yeah, up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the beauty of catch yep. and release. Yep. Yeah, it was around 15 or something. Oh. Good sized geese out there. Hey, I'm Dave from Woodbridge, up here trying to learn how to carp fish and uh, just have some corn out there. All right, cool, man. There you go. Got, got uh... yeah. You know, Dave's going to catch the biggest fish here. You just know it, too, you know? Prove, us all, pr prove that uh, we're just compensating with all the gear. It's my first day here. So <laughs> maybe I'll have better stuff next time. No, that's great, man. That's great. I told you he's gonna outfish me. <laughs> a little nice. It's caught, yeah. Okay. Oh, I know, right? It looked gold for a I meant that. We like catfish too. Yeah, yeah, it's all. But I did. I thought I seen a little gold. A little channel. <laughs> Those snails are doing good, though. Yeah. It's on crushed snails. Yeah. I could use this for bait. This is this is where the uh, where the catfish go to kindergarten. Yeah. Oh, he's so cute! He's so oh, hey there, little guy. Good, I still have a piece of a snail. There you go. <laughs> but you're rocking him. Yeah. There you go, Leah. Leah run for his money on the most catfish. Uh, it, well, it, say your name and where you're from. Uh, hi, my name's Danny, and uh, I'm from China. Ah, and... Nihoma. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay, and uh, I'm a fishing guy, car fishing guy, the yeah, most time. And then I meet Luke, everybody's it. here. Let's go. It's, I mean, it's huh? nice, you know, nice cool camp. fishing. Very good. Nice yeah. Yeah, there we go. I got the Nice, that's a in like right uh, I got a little you know sleep thing here. Mm -hmm. I got wrong carbon. Which might be uh ten pounds. Nice. Eight ten pounds. And I got the six number six hooks. Some uh what do you call the uh, uh, sink tubing. Yeah, there's a sink tubing here. Yeah. yeah, so I just put a couple here and it helps the lines get yeah. straight. Nice. If you like that video, check out some of our other great videos, including another trip I took to the DC Tidal Basin and also how to catch catfish using Pro Cured Chicken Liver. Also, don't forget to hit subscribe to get updates on other future cats and carp fishing events.